What is up YouTube? This is Reggie J Sneaks coming at you guys with a new video. And today I'll be bringing you guys a video on the flu games. But before I get into this video, <coughs> hold on, wait, let me get some tissue really quick. Hold on one second. Alright, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. But for you guys that's not familiar with my face, I did want to change up a little bit and show my face on this video. But before I get into this review and on foot, I need you guys to stop what you guys are doing. Subscribe if you guys already haven't. Also drop a like and comment down below. Let us get into this review. But before I get into this review, on the flu guys, I gotta tell you guys a little quick story about my struggle of actually copying these. Once I did get there, the line was along once I got into line, it was past my little stickers. And I was number 43 in line, and which was not bad at all. Um, Cause most people that was in line was like either looking for kid sizes or they was like really, really big, big foot people. It was like 11, a size 11 and up. So I was still kind of good cause I wear nine and a half to 10. So I probably was standing there for about an hour, hour and a half just because I thought that that store did open up a little bit early cause of the shoe release, but they did not. They opened up at 10. I think I got there like 8.30, almost nine. Yeah, standing out there for an hour, hour and a half was not that bad because the people that was in line was pretty, pretty chill, pretty cool. It was funny and was actually talkative and wanted like, you know, so serious. While waiting in line, waiting for 10 o'clock to arrive, I kept checking the sneaker app to make sure I had a pair secured just in case I, by the time I got to the front that they probably ran out. But while checking the sneaker app, it seemed like it was trying to work. You could click on the two games and once you get there, you could have selected your size and everything. Because I am logged into my sneaker app, it has all my information. But once I tried to add it to cart to buy it, it kept telling me to select my uh, shipping address. And I'm like, okay, this is my address, this is my address. You know my address already, like you already know my address. But it still didn't work. So I just thought, okay, we forgot all about this, whatever it is. And they did end up fixing the app. So a lot of people did look up waking up late and still be able to purchase the shoes off the app. But still getting back into the story. <laughs> 10 o'clock came, they stopped everybody in sh shortly by shortly. Um, by the time I got to the door, they was limited on size. I got the last nine and a half. It was no more tens. It was a ten and a half left. But you guys let me know your guys' story down in the comments down below. Now get into the review for on the flu game. As you guys already know the story behind it, a lot of people said that Jordan had the flu, but he really didn't. He had food poison, supposedly. He ate pizza before from a shop, and they said that like five people came to the door just to serve Michael Jordan's pizza. He was supposedly the only person that ate it. But Michael Jordan still came out and played a great game that night and he won even though having the full poison or a flu as they want to call it. Um, but another reason why I really want to get these shoes is because this is one of my childhood shoes that I remember having as a little kid. And I remember like my dad like being ecstatic about getting these shoes because the, I think they had just, just won the championships. But getting into the shoe, I mean the shoe is a very very clean cut shoe. You have your black tumble over here on the top with the red snake skin on the side here they get into the bottom of the shoe you have this transparent gum bottom here mix it with the black and the black and gray carbon fiber here on the bottom try to move it in and out so you guys can see it now getting into the back of the shoe you still have that black and red color scheme going here with the heel tap also back here in the back of the black 23 then here it just says Jordan and then it says quality inspired by the greatest player ever Pretty much saying the same thing it says on the back of the box. You guys probably can see it in the B-roll. Then getting into the tongue, you guys still have that black tongue leather on the top with the red jump in here. And then on the under the laces, you have that two, three for 23. A lot of people don't know that, but yeah, two and a three just for 23. But you guys let me know down in the comments down below if you guys cop these, what you guys think of these, the quality, everything. You guys let me know, complaints or whatever down in the comments below. Don't forget to drop a like. Also, subscribe if you guys already have it. In the meantime, between time you guys, let's get into this on foot. <laughs> 